The Omaha Police Union files a lawsuit on behalf of a fellow officer claiming defamation of character. The suit states that the officer was accused of killing someone when in truth he had nothing to do with the death. The comments were made to reporters by the member of the Nebraskans for Peace Group. Ann McIntyre is investigating. She joins us via our 6 View Live. We're here at 15th and Howard at police headquarters. Now, the officer in the suit is retired, and he suffers from post-traumatic stress disorder, which the union says has only been made worse by these false accusations. You cannot go around accusing people of killing someone without facts. That's what I hope to prove with this. Police union president John Wells says a lawsuit filed Thursday against Nebraskans for Peace member Mark Welsh aims to clear the name of a retired Omaha police officer. To say... We're more than happy to debate the issues. Everyone's entitled to their opinion. It's their God-given right, but you're not allowed to accuse somebody of a crime. Welsh, who has been an advocate for Robert Wagner, an alleged victim of police brutality seen in this surveillance video outside of Creighton Medical Center, made the comments during an April press conference. He talked about the shooting of Wagner's cousin, Jimmy Levering, in May of last year near 30th and Pratt. If an officer says, this job is too stressful for me, they should let him out. Because if they don't, this is what could happen. That officer is now out of that unit. He has to live with him killing a man. But that's how maybe he saw that as his only way out of that stressful situation. So he shot Jimmy in the head, killed him, and now he's on a pension for the rest of his life. And we're going to pay for that. The police union says there is no doubt Welsh was singling out Officer Ryan Sidlacek, but no officer, let alone Sidlacek, was responsible for Levering's death. That's a wild, unsubstantiated accusation, wholly untrue, uh, not a basis in fact. In fact, Ryan wasn't even working that weekend. The lawsuit doesn't say what compensation is being sought, simply that the statements have caused Sidlacek serious injury to his good name and caused him emotional stress due to fear. If Jimmy's friends believe that that individual officer or any officer with the Omaha Police Department was responsible for his death, there's a real danger that they'll look at us for retaliation. I did reach out to Mark Welsh for comment, but he tells me that he's never been sued like this before and he wanted to talk to an attorney before he makes any comments. The entire police union voted on whether to move forward with this lawsuit Tuesday. The vote came back unanimous. Reporting live, Ann McIntyre, Channel 6 News.